Hey guys, it's Andrew here from Simo Apps, and in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can detect a tab on your app if you're using Core Graphics to draw a shape such as a square or circle with a CA layer. Okay, to start off with, I've already coded up this quick, simple app here, which will draw a square on the screen. So the objective is to detect when the user taps on that square. So if you want to copy the code, you can pause now and I'll zoom in on the code. Otherwise, there's a link in the description below to paste bin, which will have all the code in there if you just want to copy and paste it straight into Xcode. Okay, so now you've got the code set up. Let's detect a tap on the square. So one thing I want to point out is that this square layer is declared outside the functions in the class level. This is because we'll need access to it in another function to detect when it has been tapped on. So to do that, what we're going to do, we're going to do touches begin. So if you type that in, the autocomplete will come up with this touches begin method. So double tap on that, and that will create this function here, override function touches begin. So what happens, this function is run every time you tap on a screen. So we're going to use this function to detect when the user taps on the screen and then check if that tap was inside the square we've drawn on the screen. So to do that, we're going to do let touch equals touches dot first. Then let point equals touch exclamation mark dot location and in will be self dot view then we're going to do if square layer dot path exclamation mark dot contains and the point is going to be the point we just created then we'll print out we tapped the square So what this is doing is we get the location the user touched on the screen, which is the point, and then we check if the square layer we drew contains that point. So let's just run that and see that working in the iOS app. Okay, so you can see the mouse here. So if we tap outside, nothing happens in the console. If we tap that red square, we can see we tap the squares in the console. So bottom left, it works. Top right, another one comes up and so on. If we tap outside it, it will not print that out. So that's how you detect a tap in a CA layer with core graphics. That will work with other shapes such as circles, stars, and so on. Any shape you've drawn. Just remember to declare the layer in the class level. That way you can access it in this touches began function. And if you want to add more shapes, you simply repeat this thing here over and over again once you've got the point. So if you had a circle shape, say it's named circle layer, you could change that to circle layer and we tap the circle. That's if we had drawn a circle on the screen. So that's quite easy to run custom code when you tap on a core graphics layer in your app. You can download the source code for this below.